My name is Susan Shimamoto, and um, the, in August of 2010, we were fortunate to take part in the Japan American Grassroots Summits program, which is a um, friendship program, fostering friendship, lifetime friendships, which is exactly what happened. Okay, these are my girls. Um, Yoko Sato and Emiko Kuga were, uh, were the two homestay women that we had for four days. When I saw what was happening on TV, um, it, it just, it was horrifying. I just couldn't get Emiko and Yoko out of our minds. It was eight days before we were able to reach Emiko by phone. And um, the relief was just overwhelming. She kept telling us that uh, what she had seen was hell. Those were her words. She just, she watched. It was like watching hell. I also saw uh, Gary Tuckman on CNN do a, a piece on Ishinomaki, where Emiko's from. We're with members of the Army right now trying to rescue these people. Well, they didn't have water. Um, they had only food that they had had in the house before the quake and the tsunami. Um, of course, the electricity was off. This is probably um, one of the worst personal experiences that I, I've ever um, gone through, and I didn't go through it. You know, it was just not knowing what, what, what happened to your friends. Oh, this is the email that I got this morning from Emiko's granddaughter, and um, she writes, I'm fine. Ishinomaki City, where I lived, was swallowed to the tsunami. I was amazed at what the JCCCNC has done uh, with the relief fund. Uh, what comes around goes around, you know. It's, I think it's very basic. It's just so basic. I think it's human nature to care. I'm just so grateful that they're okay. This has brought us closer. I'm going to go to Japan. I'm going to go check on these ladies. I have to.